What's going on guys, Scott here with SDBC. Uh, so Jesse Vargas returned to the ring for the first time in 13 months. Tonight on Premier Boxing Champions, he picked up a 10 round unanimous decision over Aaron Herrera. Uh, it was a good fight. This was the first fight since he lost to Manny Pacquiao back in 2016. So this was a good fight for Jesse Vargas. He put in a good, solid 10 rounds of action. Um, a workmanlike performance from Jesse Vargas. He looked good. He was composed. He was placing his shots well. He scored the knockdown in round number six. He basically won every single round. Um, so it was good for him to put in this work. A full 10 round fight. And um, definitely shake off that ring rust after coming off a 13 month layoff. So he looked good in this fight. Um, he calls out um, Keith Thurman, Earl Spence Jr. and Danny Garcia. He wants them next or sometime in the near future. Uh, to be honest, as good as Jesse Vargas is, I'm not sure how well he'll do against Keith Thurman or Earl Spence Jr. But you could definitely match him up with some of the other uh, belt holders or some of the other fighters in the division like Danny Garcia. I think that would be a good fight. Uh, Jeff Horn is out there. He's a world champion. Um, we'll see if he holds on to his belt if he ends up fighting Terrence Crawford next, who will now be fighting at uh, the welterweight division moving forward. Um, and, you know, there's some other guys out there as well. I saw a recent article saying he is also willing to fight Saddam Ali again in the rematch. But nonetheless, I think if Jesse Vargas stays active, stays focused, he'll definitely get those world championship fights. And um, we'll see how he does. But it was good to see him again tonight. Um, coming off a 13-month layoff, he picks up the 10-round unanimous decision victory, improving to 28-2 and two with 10 knockouts. Uh, if you saw the fights or have any uh, thoughts or comments on Jesse Vargas and who he should fight next, let me know. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and don't forget to hit subscribe to the new boxing channel, Split Decision Boxing Community. Thanks guys for watching. I'll see you next time.